Professor Hygieno Sekwazi of the University of Ibadan says the film industry has enormous value chains that can gainfully employ and accommodate many youths in Nigeria. Ekwazi, a resource person, stated this at a two-day training organized by the Nigerian Film Corporation in collaboration with Senator Kola Balogun, Oyo South Senatorial District. The nature of film is simply that wherever you are coming, you can fit into film. That is the way the industry If you're a medical doctor, or you read uh, home management, or you read mascot, or you read film, everybody can fit into film production. It's one of those professions where once you are trained, there are many places you can be trained to fit What I'm trying to say is that from the idea of the film to when the film shows on the screen, you have 253 different trades and professions. 253. Some are very important, some are not as important as others. I'm talking about the value chain. So what this means is that you can fit anywhere into it. I've said 253, not persons, but trades and professions. One person can have a lot of all those trades and professions. But it, for me, the value here in the value chain is that it is so elastic that wherever you are coming from, you can fit in there. For his part, Senator Kola Balogun said that the training was in fulfillment of his electioneering campaign to foster job creation, to reduce the rate of unemployment in the country, thereby boosting the economy. So thank God we got the people's mandate and we know that uh, the rate of unemployment in this country is mind-boggling. So if there is anything we can do to assist the economy to grow, to create uh, wealth in our nation, in our district, to generate employment for determine unemployment, this is one of the areas we are looking at. You know, Nigeria is a monolithic economy, but we need to diversify our economy. One of the areas you can look at when you talk about diversification is that the culture is uh, culture and tourism, and of course, entertainment, music and entertainment industry. So if you train 50 youth, for example, in, in the art of filmmaking, and they are empowered to begin to practice. Each one of them probably will also hire one or two or three people. That way you have the multiplier effect. That way you're also making your own quota, your contribution to the development of the economy. In his remarks, Mr. Edmond Obi, a lecturer at the Nigerian Film Corporation, said stages of filmmaking and production would be taught during the training by seasoned experts and professionals.